If anybody cares, I am going to read you a poem I wrote years ago in school. The date there says February 27, 1994. So that's almost 20 years old. The poem has a little introduction. An absurdly long name is a very popular Greek hero. He has been traveling a total of 70 years, trying to get back home after the Trojan War. Down below are a few passages from Book 10 of that long name's great journey. Our preceding landfall was on an isle of murky. Dire physical creation and splendidness that a homo sapien could not refrain from rejoicing in a comic manner. We came upon the shore to immediately drift away in subconsciousness. Our slumber was gay and it was a gift from Laze, the god of rest. I arose a week from the date that our slumber commenced, but my lazy crew remained at rest without signs of waking. My optical organs recognized an unfamiliar image to my cranium. It was dirt black, like an unplugged television set. So I had a conference with another very long name, my other personality, should we very, very long name and very long name, approach the object, or should we wake the vagabounds and bums of our crew and nourish them with our spoons to their throats? A god set out a female person to wander near our camp, who the locals say Merke when speaking about or to her. With graceful motion, pure poetic form, I slugged her in the chest with a cheap imitation Louisville slugger. She, she tumbled to the soil. I yanked out her cardiac muscle, blood dripping all over. The heart fed four men. Others were nursed by the likes of kidneys, brains, and thighs. A section of the body, which we did not finish, we toted onto our vessel to let it freeze, so it would be fresh when we feast again. What do you think?